It's time for Sean Shepard to catch up with that crazy bugger, Sebastian Sassville, on his cross-Canada journey to outrun diabetes. Find out where Sebastian is now and hear all about his crazy adventures, all right here on the Diabetes Champions Network. All right, it's Sean Shepard here with Sebastian Sassaville. The last time we're doing one of these Skype interviews, 23 interviews later, um, you are, I think it's about 7,200 kilometers, a little bit more than that into your journey. Started yeah. February 2nd in Newfoundland. You're in BC, and it's ironic you're in Hope, BC. What better place to be than in Hope? Yeah. <laughs> so, one. No, yeah. I'm excited. It's, uh, I got about 2 220 to go. So, um, it's, um, it's incredible. Uh, a month ago, two months ago, I started to kind of feel, wow, this is actually going to happen. And uh, it was so cool. And and now, just a week or two before finish line, it's like, it's surreal. It's like, oh my God, like I can't believe it. Uh, so it's really cool. Well, and, and one of the questions that all of us have been getting, and I know you were getting these daily, is... How, people want to be a part of that on World Diabetes Day. They want to be part of that special day of you crossing the finish line in Vancouver. And uh, it's not possible for a lot of people unless you live right in Vancouver. So we have some exciting news uh, to share about how everybody can be a part of your special day next Friday. Yeah, so uh, we're really proud to announce um, that on uh, Friday the 14th, that 3 p.m. Pacific, that's correct? Correct. So we are going to do one of those interviews uh, with yourself, myself, and Patrick uh, live on the uh, internet machine. So uh, wherever you live in Canada, in the world, uh, 3 p.m. Pacific, that's going to be the very first interview uh, after crossing the finish line. I'm sure there will be a lot of very uh, raw emotions, a lot of joy, and it's just going to be um, you know, a very cool way to reflect on the run and, sh you know, talk about like a completed mission for the first time. So it's going to be very awesome. Yeah. And I'm really happy that we were able to do this because I know, Sebastian, right from day one in Newfoundland, you've said uh, the run is about everybody else and what you can do to inspire them. And and to, this was really important that you shared it with everybody else. So I want to uh, give a big thank you to you and and Patrick, I know you're hiding back there. Where is Patrick? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey. There you go. Um, I just want to give a big thank you. You know, this is kind of the second last interview, but um, people don't know um, what Patrick has done um, right from day one. You've lived with Sebastian for nine months. Um, <laughs> When I went out on the road with you guys for like three days of nine months, um, just the love and the care that, that Patrick takes in this whole journey. And I just want to thank you for everything that you've done. Um, I've noticed that the beard and the hair, um, you promised in Toronto you wouldn't shave or and you kept your word. Um, just a big thank you to both of you for, for sharing this with everybody. You're welcome. Our pleasure, and we hope it was useful. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We <laughs> I hope. I think so. Someone. So, how do you feel? You're, you're, you know, you're within two weeks of the finish line. How do both you guys feel? Oh, I mean, how do you feel? Like, I am pretty excited, but uh, yeah, I could still go for another month. I don't. <laughs> think, I don't think <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't think I could. I don't think I could. No, it's been tough. Um, it's been, the Rockies were really, really tough, tougher than expected. Um, we're tired. Uh, the you know, winter's coming back. It's raining. Uh, I've been a little sick. Uh, you know, that, 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 that kind of stuff that's made the, the days a lot tougher. But, it, yeah, it's amazing how, like, the, the power of the finish line is, is, is super cool. So uh, we're hoping to see a lot of people there on the 14th. Um, you know, we'll actually make more announcements about that very soon. How can people be there, participate into the finish line celebration? We're going to try to make it very, very accessible to, to anyone who lives in Vancouver. So, um, so yeah, it's, it's very, very awesome um, to be there. 
And and how do I know you've got the hashtag Go Seb Go uh, and the Facebook page? Um, can you both talk about what that means to you to see that support every day from right across, not just across the country, but around the world? Um, Patrick. <laughs> I mean, the hashtag says go, set, go, so yeah. smashing. <laughs> I think we need a go, pad, go hashtag. <laughs> yeah, I thought about it. <laughs> yeah. But it's pretty cool to see people um, supporting uh, supporting Fed, supporting the run, uh, and what it means um, on on everywhere on, on, uh, on the internet. And, uh, yeah, I mean, sometimes we don't... We, we don't always see that because we are uh, in the RV on the road, or, or just you know running and, and driving, and, and then uh, with, with, with that fantastic um, thing that is called the internet, we can we kind of feel the love that we get and uh, that we that we receive from the, from the people all across the country, and yeah, that's quite cool. Yeah, and we're seeing the momentum pick up on our social media outlets, uh, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook is huge. You know, more likes, more shares, uh, a lot more go, step, go, uh, go, step, go. So it's cool. It's, it's, that too gives us a lot of energy to keep doing what we do. Um, um, so it's, it's, yeah, it's the number one way people can, can support us right now. And how many kilometers to go, Sebastian? Uh, two twenty. Two twenty. But who who's counting, right? Counting. <laughs> I am. Uh, well, you know, a huge congratulations. I know that uh, when you started this, both of you didn't know what was in front of you, um, and now you're close to the finish line. Uh, we're cheering loud and proud, and um, you know we're with you. Can't wait to uh, to be with you guys next week in Vancouver, and uh, really looking forward to to both of you sharing your experience with uh, everybody in the live stream interview. So thank you again. Yeah, looking forward yeah. to it, and we'll share the links uh, on how to subscribe and how to watch uh, in the coming hours, I guess. In the coming hours, and congratulations to Patrick. Uh, I've never, I've worked with lots of companies, but I've never seen an employee of the month nine months in a row. That's rare. <laughs> That's awesome. Very rare. Yeah. I'm proud of it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. Thanks. Be safe, guys. And uh, thanks, we'll man. see you yeah. next week. Next week. See you next week. Bye. See you in Vancouver. Yes. Yeah.